Hey folks, how you doing? Out here, uh, I just stopped at this clear cut for a few minutes. Let the sun rear its head up. Um, I'm going to try a different tactic today. I'm going to use uh, my Hunt X, uh, Hunt Stand app. And I'm going to look at some aerial photographs. I'm trying to find a, a swamp area that I can hike into. So it can't be too far off the road. But hopefully it's hidden enough that other people don't know about it. You know that is <laughs> you think you found something brand new and you find somebody there but um it's supposed to be a little bit warmer day today so i think i can do a little bit of walking into something um and not be so, quite so cold it was super cold yesterday i'm up at camp in the morning anyway it warmed up a little bit it's supposed to be a little bit warmer here today so we'll see but um i'm gonna use this app to try and drive down the road a little bit and find a swamp that I see um, that's off the road. I th thought there was a pond I, off of here. I could have swore when I was, last time I was hunting here, I was looking at, at my hunt stand up and uh, showed a pond in the woods just on the other side of the road here, but it's not there now. I don't know if they keep changing photography or what's going on, but who knows? And anyway, I'll go down the road here in a mile. That's light enough. I haven't had any uh, real luck in this spot, so I'm not going to stay here. Um, yep, yeah, I'm going to head down there now. I'll uh, get you some more footage when I get around to the spot. stand up has brought me to this area here i am gonna get out and try and do a little bit of walking with crutches i was saying gonna be able to go very far but some swamps in here and there's a sort of an older tote road that there's a rock in the way of it so you can't drive down it you so you have to walk it so who knows don't hurt to try right just want to do something different i'm getting tired of same old places not panning out I figure maybe something new will at least, you know, get yourself doing a little bit of scouting as well as hunting. Still a frosty morning. I think it was like 27 degrees. Plus we're in the 40s later on, so. Get some more footage while I'm out there. Hey folks. I try this spot for, for a little bit. Not too super far from the truck, but I can't walk a long ways stuff is not too bad but it's a lot of moose sign and I'm not I've never been down here so I don't know how the train is and where to walk and where to sit so I'm gonna kind of back myself into this fir tree here and watch down this way here maybe something will show up show you what I got
I'm gonna get up and take a walk further down this trail a little bit further. I got this sun right in my eyes right here and I don't like that because you can't see down there very well and plus if you aim at something the sun will reflect off of your lens of your scope directly at whatever you're aiming at and spook it off. I've had that happen before. So if I can get into some more shady area down further this is all in a new area to me so I don't know what's gonna be down there and all so we'll see what see what I can find I'll get you some more footage when I got something to show you well, I hope that guy's gone as far as I can go yeah there's a trail in there it's like a moose trail but maybe we can wake too much no way he's going any further than that so I'll head back the way I came going back that way poke along. There was a couple of good spots I passed on the way through here. I just want to see how far this goes, but it goes all the way to a big swamp, but make too much noise and it's way too hard for me to walk in that stuff, so I'm going to head back that way. Let's see what I see. Been a lot of moose around here. See all those buds are all nipped off. Over here. One thing my brother and I have been noticing, even when you watch a lot of the YouTube videos, people tracking the big bucks. They like to hang around with a moose. There's a little ball right in there. I don't know if I can get to it or not, but I thought there was an opening in the woods down here. We'll see. Just gonna make sure I don't get trampled by a moose. Oh, well, this don't happen very often, but I walked all the way down there. Come back to right where I was, because this area seemed like the best promise for this area. This is that sun's in my eyes right now. I took my uh, snips and snipped out a little spot into this tree for me and put all the boughs in front of me. Try and block my uh outline a little bit in this tree. You can see that. Plus I'm gonna lean into it. <clears throat> Get a little bit more comfortable. Well, the sun is right in my eyes, but it shouldn't be there for a whole lot longer. I had some deer scent, but I had taken it out, put it in a Ziploc bag in the truck, and I forgot to put it back in my pocket. I intended to put something out there. Or something. <laughs> so I'm gonna sit here for a little bit, let everything calm down, and hopefully, whew, hopefully something comes out. It's supposed to be in the 40s today. It's getting warmer, definitely, especially with that sunshine on me. But uh, I might snip this out a little bit more, get a little bit more comfortable, and wait here for quite a while. We'll see how it goes. It's a lot of moose sign, so it's really hard to tell tracks because the ground's so hard and packed a lot of rock in it so you can't even barely see moose tracks so we'll see how she goes see I threw all the pieces of the pine against that old bush there to try and break up I outline a little bit better snipped it all the branches around we'll see how it goes Sitting tucked under this tree, cut a little hole with some snips. I'm watching that area still. I think it's just after 11 o'clock now. I've uh, been watching a hawk. Other than that, I haven't seen much of anything else. It's kind of warm now, though. It's like, I think it's 47 degrees, so. I'm not sure if I might just stick it out here for the rest of the day. No sense of. Traveling, wasting a lot of fuel, it's not a bad spot, but this one place is better than any other, I guess. Let's see what happens.
Just gotta have a nice warm sunny day for once. Just doing what Mother Nature does. The wind's kind of changing now and it's blowing all my scent straight down where I'm trying to watch. So that ain't gonna work. It's a good spot, I just need a better wind than this. So I'm gonna have to pull out of here and head back to the truck. I drove by a clear cut area. Uh, looked like some potential there. And a couple of other spots too, so I'm gonna head back and <clears throat> get in the truck and see if I find a better spot with the wind. The wind is just now it's blowing in my face. It's been quartering over to this way, but now it's started to go that way. But it's just swirling around here. Just wasting my time. Well, to be continued, we'll see what happens. Hello, finally chose a spot to sit. Been watching my Hunt X stand app and trying to find a place close to a swamp. So I chose this spot right here. It's, in the, it's a hard, hardwood ridge. And down below, down this way, is a swamp down there. So I'm hoping maybe I'll catch some deer. Either getting to that swamp or coming out of that swamp, heading up this way. But nothing, I guess. <laughs> Worth a try. Show you what I have. Okay, in there, I don't know if you can catch the reflection of the water or not, but the swamp's just down that way, slow ways. So all kinds of beech trees in here, so there'll be plenty of beech nuts for food, feed. It's like a drainage right here. And an opening up there, and the road's up there. Drainage would come down and head toward that swamp. Let's get a trail behind me right there. Probably else goes down towards the edge of the swamp. I'm just winging it today. Just want to do something different. Nothing else seems to be working, so. That is squirrely wind here. I think this wind is in my favor here, I think. It was when I got out of the truck. See what happens.
It's just about three o'clock. About an hour and a half left. Haven't seen much here. Just saw a big bird take off down there. That's about it. Pretty quiet area. Thought for sure there'd be some stuff around where this swamp is right down at the bottom here. It's a pretty large swamp, but so far nothing. We'll see, how and a half left.
I see it the park. Well, just getting back to the truck. Well, that was a little eventful, that partridge. I thought for sure it could have been something a little bit bigger, but they always sound huge. That leaf litter is probably four inches at least, maybe six inches deep in some places. It was a pain trying to walk back because you, you just don't know <laughs> how deep you're going to go or what you're stepping on or whatever. It was a little trick getting back out of there, but it wasn't too bad. Well... Another day down, no deer. Hopefully I have better luck tomorrow. I'm kind of debating on whether to do a clear cut tomorrow. I might do that. Well, we'll see what happens. Thank you all for watching.